So first of all, welcome back to CISG 114, Section 2. Today is day number 28 into the semester, week number 14. Actually, we have one more class to go next Monday, together with one makeup class next Tuesday, in the same room, at the same time. Now, we have many speakers today to make the speeches of the semester. So if I'm correct, so I would like to give the time to Joanna first, and then followed by Norman, and then uh, go to Brandon, and then uh, I think uh, uh, Bobby and Max also. So uh, I would like to pass the time to you. Do you need to use your wiki? Okay, it's really up to you. Okay. Make haste, Vincent. Uh, Joanna is about to make her speech of the semester. Welcome back. Well, I'm going to start my speech about like how I started with this course. I was late since I didn't enroll for this course as early as other people did. So I came into class at around week three, a uh, week two. So um, that was the first class I came in. I did not know what I was going to do. And thank you, for professor, for explaining it again to me fluently and effectively and I got to know something the first class I still remember it was about um, social responsibility and I've encountered this topic before in business class that I learned in high school but I never really got in that and never really get a chance to look for more information about it and this time I actually got the chance to actually look for my own information and learn about it and I actually thought that it was all about business, but apparently it's about our environment and our community at the same time. And by providing all those um, sources online, it enhanced my knowledge and acknowledgement of this problem that we're having in this world. Uh, businesses might not be social cooperative and may not and consider our environment as part of their um, concern. But there are companies which I studied, such as um, like Body Shop. They actually did um, do not test them uh, animals, which is a really responsible way to start of a business. And um, that was my learning contract number one. I did not really know how to do it, but I tried to follow the instruction that you provided us and all those resources and online website. And that's when I started, I thought I did it right, but apparently I have to communicate with my parents, uh, my members, which I got to. And thanks, thanks to their advice and their comments about my proposal, I got to like fill in more information about it and I know what I did badly and I actually get feedback for my work. And when it comes to the learning contracts, so you get to do it with the team. And our team got, we got five members in our team. We started off with our online journals personally, um, without, again, without knowing how to collaborate properly at first. And we get to, we had conflict about the topics that we were trying to pick on. And, we ended up doing our own personal journal and we get to vote for which is better for us and we chose e-learning. And I never thought that working with four guys would be a great thing to me since I don't really know, know how to communicate that well. And um, when it comes to le uh, language barrier, I do have language barrier with them. I can't really understand Chinese that much and they can't really understand my language that much and we got misunderstanding sometimes but when it comes to time we try to cooperate with each other and understand each other and compromise with each other and it became more easier for me and for them and I got to learn about the history of e-learning, what we're actually, what, exactly what we're doing now, like using through Wiki and through other stuff that you provided, it actually is an e-learning thing too. 
And the, it fascinates me the most about it is that um, by doing the process, I get to learn more about it other than just going online and, learn, and look for information. And I'm really thankful about the, the sources that you've provided us and the way you've taught us. And even though I'm always not here or like missing class, but I actually get to learn more than other courses in a certain way about um, not only knowledge, but actually cooperating in this society. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much, Joanna, for making the speech of the semester. So the next person's from the same group, it's uh, John Lawman. Which one would like to go first? Lawman? Okay, thank you, Lawman. Just pick up the microphone and share with us your experience in this semester. Hello, everyone. My name is Norman. Today, I will share what I learned from the semester of CIS G11402. The first thing what I learned is how to use UA model. Everyone know how, how important UA model is because your all assignment is based on it. And then, I learned how to write journal. This is a simple report can reflect what you observe and encourage you thinking about this topic. It helped me deep a currency one topic. We also learn about proposal. This part is question yourself some important issue and give the source where you can find the answer. This mention can inspire your thinking and indicate what you analyze and uh, in indicate you analyze this problem deeply. After that, we know how to use discussion form to discuss our topic and analyze our view for share to others. Meanwhile, lecture also made me know what is web technology, security, and lot of current news about web technology. And then we have team project. We need to group together and analyze topic and consider it whether have some meaningful questions. In the process, we learned how to cooperate and distribute the assignment. Also, exchanges each other advice and suggestion. We indicate what need input and what is disadvantage. disadvantage. It may me know what I need to improve and I will do the more better on next time. In class, lecture also let us report what do you do after class. It is a nice chance to ask for presentation and prepare our courage. So this course not only improve our knowledge about web technology, but also improve our speaking. This course related to our other course maybe have more assignment to do, but it really helped us become more collaborative to solve this course a serious journal project report and so on. All in all, this course I learned lots of things. It concludes knowledge about web technology, even format about report and lot of meaningful skills. Thank you very much, Laman. Thank you very much for your speech of the semester. So the next speaker from the same group is John. Hello. Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I'm going to share my, uh, do my final speech in this class. Uh, I do my journal a few days ago and I find out I'm not uh, very familiar with this type of learning uh, academic essay. And then uh, in the past when I try to read an uh, academic essay, uh, I will just read and remember the content in the essay. But I won't think, um, I won't think the content, what is the meaning of the contents. And however, and in this class, I have to use the OIA um, style to think about the essay. And it, although it takes more time to think and think about the content, um, 
but in fact I get more things in the essays when I read it. And although it takes more time for me to read. And uh, in this course I there was many, many uh, good assignments to do. And in this assignment we need to uh, cooperate with other people and need to have a discussion for a long time to communicate with our group member. And in this process, I learned about how to use digital device like discussion forum to communicate with, with each other. <laughs> and um, I learned practice more about how to communicate with uh, my group member and settlement a uh, good time to have a meeting time. And this gives me a chance to practice this and make me more skillful at these skills. And that's my end of my speech. Thank you, John. Thank you. <laughs> and the next person, is it Eddie? Are you ready? Okay. Uh, Apple will only do it next Monday or today. <coughs> today. So, will you like to take the slot now? We have the slot for you now. Or you want to take some more time? Okay, thank you, Apple. Good morning, everyone. I'm Apple, and I want to share my experience on this course, CISG. Um, in this course, what I have studied, um, I have studied how to uh, do a journal, uh, how to do a proposal of, uh, uh, of a subject, what I need to do, and then uh, uh, I think that uh, the, journey, the journal we need to use OIA to finish journal. I think this is a good struggle for you all, for my future and uh, my future. In the future, if I need to search something or study something, if I use OIA, it's very good for my study. And then, uh, uh, but uh, I have some suggestion for the discussion forum. And I think the discussion forum is not convenient for us, and uh, it may change to uh, something like the something like Facebook chat room, the the, the mode, yeah. And it will be more convenient for us to have a discussion uh, on, on the internet. Um, and in this class, I learned one thing is very, very important. What is learn to learn? Yeah. Uh, learn to learn is very good for uh, human. Yeah, I think. Uh, when, when I am a uh, secondary school student, uh, my teacher just teach and I just learn. Uh, so, uh, everything I learned from my teacher, and but and in this class, uh, everything I learned by myself. This is very good for our future, in uh, because and in the future everything we need to learn by ourselves. So this is uh, this call, uh, this course concept is very good. So. Uh, that's all I want to share, share to you. Thank you, Apple, for making a very concise and brief and relevant speech. So, Brandon, you are the next speaker. Are you ready? Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Today I talk about what I have learned in this course. I will talk some topics I'm interested in. In week one, I've learned what is web technology and its impact in life. Web technology is 
is the establishment and use of mechanisms that make it possible for different computers to communicate and share resources. In week two, I have learned what is information technology. It refers to anything related to computer technology such as networking hardware, software, the internet, or the people that work with these technologies. Also, it's my learning culture number one topic. I think the assignment is good for our organizations. I'm interested in discussions. I'm happy to discuss with my partner. We also share our opinions. In this context, we need to plan the times, devise the work, and brainstorm. When I finish this report, I have a great sense of achievement. In week seven, I have learned what is web, social web. In general, a social web is a website where people can interact with each other. Also, our social web includes many, <coughs> many kinds of information and related to our life. In not learning contracts number three, I've learned social networking. It refers to as a virtual communities or profile size. Um, social networking, a social network is a website that brings people together to talk, share ideas and interests or make friends. In this learning, I've learned how to organize our information and searching information and commit, commit with teammates, devise the words to each other and arrange the times. In conclusions, I think the most important in this course is learn to learn. Learn to learn can make can improve our memories and learning power strategy thinking and ability to study and focus and attention span. Thank you for CISG Moment 4. Thank you, Brandon. <laughs> okay, now the next speaker is Bobby. Are you ready, Bobby?
on learning function number three is teaches me that self learning not only refers to understanding but also the uh, correction after misunderstanding. And teamwork is the most impressed lesson for me to have learned through this course. Uh, as team members, uh, we meet each other several times and work together in joyful atmosphere, which made our pro process going quickly and fluently. Uh, I'm glad to work with Max, Ivy, and Coco. Um, I'm glad when we got through the difficulties in this course. So, though I didn't study in it perfectly in this course, I think I somehow have gotten benefits from this uh, uh, new way of learning. Uh, that's all. Thank you, Bobby. Thank you very much for your short and concise speech. Uh, Coco, are you ready to do the speech today? Okay, you're the next speaker. Thank you, Coco. Thank you, Coco. Thank 
you very much for making your sharing. Now, Eddie, are you ready? I am a passive guy in secondary school, and now I am, I am in a university. I because many assignment in other course, I must be an active guy person. And uh, anyways, in this course, I learn uh, I learn many new things in this course and have many first experience. For example. Uh, just I mentioned before, I'm a passive guy, so I always talk to learn, not learn to learn, but uh, past many times I have a detour between the uh, become a learn to learn student, and uh, I think learning culture is a good assignment for us because they can have uh, good work. You can do it by yourself and mm, uh, the other hand is I think Professor in Dong didn't want doesn't want us feel bored so always let me watch the video many times. <laughs> and I think the I mean the video is very interesting because the IT thing is very uh, useful for our daily life. Uh, I have a post to process it all. <laughs> and fi finally, I make, a, make some new plan in this class. So I thank you all. Thank you. Thank you very much, Eddie, for making a speech of the semester. OK, any, any more speakers today? Max, are you going to do it today? Okay, Max, thank you. Good morning, everyone. My name is Max, and today I'm going to share some of my feelings in this course. And I've learned a lot in this course. I learned that there is a big relationship between web technology and our life. I learned how to use human model and wiki. It is very important for my study. And I've learned how to use OIA form to write journal. And I learned how to communicate with my teammate. I remember that in the first learning project. I think that it is very difficult and my group mate and I go to farm Totawan and Totawan is very nice and help us to solve the problem. We have the experience in the learning contract number one and we think that learning contract number three is not very difficult. We have a group plan to finish it. Unluckily, we don't have enough time to finish it on time. This course has me go a lot. I've learned many skills in this course and I think I can manage my time better. Thank you. Thank you, Max. Thank you very much. Any, any more volunteer speaker? Thank you, Rufus. My name is Rufus and I think this course is something different with my other course but I have learned many things in this course can help me in my remaining university life. The first time I saw the model of this course, I just think, I was just afraid of it. <laughs> the UN model of this course has a lot of information. I couldn't use it very well in the first few weeks. 
I couldn't find what I want because there are so many things on it. But when I guess how to use this Moodle, I know the Moodle of this course is the most useful than my other course. Then I think the wiki is very interesting. We can put something on the wiki space and exchange information on the wiki space. The most interesting features is we can edit the wiki space be what we want. I really like this feature and I can't believe that I can create a page my own for my preview work in this semester about this course. But I done it, that made me very excited. Almost assignment in this course are doing in a teamwork. In this course I learned how to work in a team <coughs> in a team. I know there will be many teamwork in my remaining few years in my university life. So I think this course can help me a lot. I'm sure I couldn't done those assignments alone. The biggest thing I have learned is how to work in a team. Thank you. Thank you, Rufus. Thank you very much. Neil? Thank you, Neil. Hello oh, everyone, I'm Leo. And in this class, I yeah, just one more for I learned something in this class. First, I learned how to use two and Moodle because in this class, two and Moodle is very important. Uh, I always find some information in the Moodle, and every week you can learn something and you can find in two and Moodle. Uh, and see some video in the UN Moodle about the this car second in the car and uh, it has two projects and uh, LC CO01 and LC CO03 uh, in the LC CO01 and uh, I am my good member cannot turn the LC CO01 because we don't know how to do the LC CO01 journal and others. I think we forget to go to check the UN Moodle so we cannot done the project. Uh, but in LC CO03 we can done the project because this project we always check the UN Moodle and learn how to do the journal. And our topic is what is social networking. In this topic I learned the advantage and disadvantage about using social networking. And we can finish this project. Uh, I think teamwork is very important in this project. And file, uh, I think this card can improve my English and technology of presentation. Because in this card, I always share my idea with other people. Thank you. Thank you, Neil. Thank you very much for your expressions. Thank you. Any more? Erica, thank you.
this message, all of this message is very uh, fresh for me. <laughs> and second, uh, uh, it was my first time to uh, make a report uh, in team, in a team. And this is have, have a lot of challenge for me because in my high school life or uh, mid school life, I never do something like this. And but it was challenge, but it was very interesting because all of us will have some mistake in when we do the report. But uh, luckily, we have other uh, members can help us to. Uh, let us uh, let our mistake become a, a, a right <laughs> um, and uh, sir uh, in this cause it really had many works yes <laughs> and it was busy but uh, it was substan substantial for me, and uh, I think this course uh, was not only talk about knowledge about web, and it also teach me a lot about how to uh, how to how to discuss with others, how to uh, communicate with my group members, and how to. Uh, got the skills uh, which was very useful in my uh, learning and I think this course is very interesting for me and finally I must to say thanks for my teacher and my group members um, because uh, I'm not really easy to understand about the message of because terror in English I never uh, have class like this and uh, my teacher always helped me when the class over <laughs> and just kept full of patience that uh, repeat my uh, questions answer again and again and my uh, group members just helped me to uh, understand message when teachers say them in the class. I think uh, it was giving me many encourage to help, uh, to make my study life more better. Thank you. Thank you, Erica. <laughs> okay, we have uh, two to three more speakers next Monday. Uh, next Monday is November the 30th, according to the school's calendar, is the last day of the semester. Now, according to the advice given by the Vice Rector in Academic Affairs, this semester, actually starting from this semester, we have a new way to evaluate our courses. Instead of calling it course evaluations, we call it student feedback questionnaire. Now, the student feedback questionnaire you are going to do next Monday on the very last day of the class is very much like the course end of the semester course survey that you finished at the very end last week and the result I report to you already um, in our last class. So be sure you come back next Monday to finish the student feedback questionnaire which is very important for this course. Okay, And then after that I think we are going to have a very interesting time together. We need to celebrate. All right. Maybe we need to bring some fruit back here and make it as a farewell party for this course. All right, so allow me to take attendance for the day and then we can call it. Um, maybe we can have an early lunch today. So, let's see. Joanna is here. Norman is here. Okay. Uh, John is here. Mike is here. Erica is here. Vincent is here. Then Big is here, May is here, Apple is here, <laughs> and then Coco is here, Kelvin, Kelvin is not here today, and then Brandon is here, Bobby is here, all right, so Eddie is here, Max is here, Rufus is here, and 
as Neo is here. Okay, everybody, almost everybody is at the counter this month here. Now you do have any other questions you can ask me, but make sure you spend some time reading the teacher's message of today. Okay? The teacher's message of today means to tell you that this is the way we are going to calculate your score in the semester. For many contracts, number one, sure, everyone will got 10% straight. But you still have to put the, the earn the score that I gave you the score in your e-portfolio, all right? Along with the items of this type. And then you do not have to do it for learning contract number two because that's the one we skip. But for learning contract number three, we have 10 items uh, which will total about 100 points. The actual is 100 points. And you will get back the score uh, by next Monday because I'm I'm really occupied getting back to school and learning contract number for you, all the students. Okay? So then you need also to keep track of the midterm exam score is already released. You can check it under the midterm exam link. In the midterm exam block, there is a link called assessment. Click into the assessment link, choose your name, okay, and then you can see the score on midterm exam. And after that, just the learn to learn activity. You have to make sure in your e-portfolio, you have a specific page called Learn to Learn Score. When I click into that Learn to Learn page, you will have 10 journals and 5 blocks there. Then you can give yourself 15 points. Remember, as long as you put it there, you will have 15 points. You can give it. Okay, and then an in-class participation score, 20%. You must. Have an in-class participation score page in your e-portfolio. When I click into this page, you have a table of records. Ten such records, each record will give you two points. If you do not have ten, put as many records as there. Each record must contain the following: the day of the semester, for example. Today's day, day 28 of the semester. And then today's day of the year is November the 26, 2015. And YouTube link. The minute start, the minute end, where you appear in the video, and the sub descriptions of what you said. This is considered as one record. 10 sub record, 20 points you give yourself. Okay? I just check it and it's there, I'll give it 20 points. If you do not have 10 such record, make sure that most of you have actually done your semester speech. Make sure you add speech of the semester into the front page of your e-portfolio where when I click into the speech there, I can see again the day when you make the speech, the day of the year when you make the speech, the YouTube link, the minutes, and the topic, okay? So you have to make sure that you got the links there and I will give the score our 10th semester point, okay? So after that, it's the, um, it's the, it's the way that you know that this is the original assessment plan with free learning contract. Now we opt our learning contract number two. So this is the adjusted plan with only two contracts, okay? Okay, let me see. I did not take this out. Here, adjusted plan, yes. Only learning contract one and learning contract three. So learning contract three will be 20%. And 30%, not, this is not 30%, this is 20% for the learning equal for I make a mistake here. And then uh, learn to learn score 15, the 15 mid, mid, midterm exam and, uh, and an in-class participation is 20%. I need to make sure this is not uh, this is not, not right. I have to make sure that the number is correct. Remember, equal for is 20%, in-class participation is 20%. And then for the speech of the semester, you have an extra 10%. Oh, I was I was a little bit slippy this morning, so I, I, I did it wrong the figures. Now I check it. But you know it that this is the based on the original plan. Uh, nothing changed except for uh, move 10% to learning contract number three and add 10% extra for the speech of the semester. And then next Monday when you come back we will do the uh, official student feedback questionnaire. So that is the message of this week. Okay, so in your e-portfolio, you must have the front page with all the score listed out so that you know what score you get and what grade you're going to get. 
What you need to trace up to me is give me back the learning content free score as soon as next Monday or Tuesday. All right? So this is what I have to do. Very easy. All right. So enjoy your time. And I'm glad that you're here. We have a long semester together. Let's have a party. All right? Next week. Monday and Tuesday. Oh, maybe I, I get really a movie for you on Tuesday. We watch a movie. Tuesday is the makeup class, the only one makeup class of the semester. Monday is the last day of the semester, so you need to come back, alright? So, alright. Enjoy yourself. So that's it for today's CISG 114 section 2, day 28, alright?